Almost every golfer I know would like to spend a, a session on the practice tee with Tiger Woods. I mean, learn from the best. Business people I know always dream about having dinner with Bill Gates or Warren Buffett. Just a lot to learn from guys like that. Musicians want to hang out with Bono. Uh, sailors, they all want to get on a boat sometime with Dennis Conner or Russell Coots. But those of us who are Christ followers, I think we should probably imagine what it would be like to be able to sit down to dinner with Jesus Christ and just learn from the master. Learn from the one who would walk into various social settings and just have a beam on who needed attention, who needed grace, who needed forgiveness, who needed a word of encouragement. And he would walk right across the room in those settings and he would offer it freely and lovingly, compassionately. We have the opportunity to learn from the master and we can become the kinds of people who walk across rooms just like he did. To all the saints in Christ Jesus at Philippi, I thank my God every time I remember you. In all my prayers for all of you, I always pray with joy because of your partnership in the gospel. From the first day until now, being confident of this, that he who began a good work in you will carry it on to completion until the day of Christ Jesus. Now, I want you to know, brothers, that what has happened to me has really served to advance the gospel. As a result, it has become clear throughout the whole palace guard and to everyone else that I am in chains for Christ. Because of my chains, most of the brothers in the Lord have been encouraged to speak the word of God more courageously and fearlessly. Yes, and I will continue to rejoice, for I know that through your prayers and the help given by the Spirit of Jesus Christ, what has happened to me will turn out for my deliverance. I eagerly expect and hope that I will in no way be ashamed, but will have sufficient courage so that now, as always, Christ will be exalted in my body whether by life or by death. For to me, to live is Christ, and to die is gain.